some 2,500 miles away from the Quad Cities, ocean waters are churning and the winds are changing. This is the climate pattern known as La Nina, and it is going to play a big role in our upcoming winter season. You can see it clearly here on the map, blue colors here in the Eastern Pacific, right off the coast of South America, indicating those cooler than normal water temperatures. So how can something that is so far away, thousands of miles away from the Quad Cities, have such a big impact on not just the weather here, but across the globe? Let's dig in. La Nina is nothing new. The Quad Cities has experienced a dozen La Nina events since the 1950s, and likely more even before then. Here's how La Nina works. The ocean temperatures in the eastern Pacific quickly begin to cool below average by about one degree Fahrenheit. The expanded area of cooler than normal water shifts thunderstorm activity along the equator westward. Strong storm activity pumps heat and moisture into the upper level of the atmosphere, disturbing global weather patterns. The storm track begins to pull back and retract toward Asia. West of the United States, high pressure parks southwest of Alaska, while low pressure develops in the northwest U.S. Along with an active storm track, past history has shown that La Ninas bring more Arctic outbreaks across the northern U.S., while also bringing wetter-than-average conditions to that same region. 